unmistakable view from a bluff overlooking Phoenix, Arizona. It's Diamondbacks baseball next on the show. And what's going on, YouTube? It is Mr. Lux, a.k.a. The Merry Gamer, and I'm back at you with another MLB 14 The Show player lock. And in this player lock, we are going to focus on Paul Goldschmidt of the Arizona Diamondbacks, another player lock that has been highly requested by you guys. I've got a lot of requests for this for this particular individual. So we're about to jump into this. Now, in this player lock, you're going to hear some, some background talk in which it was me doing a live stream. And I was wearing the uh, Sony PlayStation Gold headset. The headset itself is great. The mic, the not so much. Uh, the microphone is Bluetooth, and it, it definitely sounds like it uh, when you're gaming. Uh, it's fine for phone conversations, but for gameplay, the microphone, it leaves a lot to be desired. So I decided instead of me posting this video with that particular commentary, I would just go ahead and give some updated commentary. So here we go. Paul Goldschmidt, this bottom of the first... Zero zero, we're dialed in. And he'll power in a fastball that time at good pitch. That was a good pitch. Right. So, a uh, little tip for people who play this game who are having trouble hitting: the majority of the pitches that the AI throws are always going to be low in the zone. The majority of them, not every pitch, but the majority will be low in the zone. And that was a weak pop out to right. Um, but yeah, so if you're using your uh, PCI hitting, you may want to have your cursor down a little bit so you can make, uh, you know, better contact. But that's just something that just, you know, I thought I'd pass along because it does uh, happen to uh, always be low in the zone when the AI pitches to you. So, you know, play at first base, some player lock positions aren't that exciting, uh, like catcher, First base oh, out his first and pitcher. Out Those three positions aren't exciting because you're you're pretty much stationary for the most part when you're playing defense, and that's why you don't see me posting many. Uh -oh, uh -oh. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, but um, that's why you don't see me posting many uh, pitcher player locks because a player lock as a pitcher is nothing more than just an actual game. There's nothing unique about the camera angle. Um, the, you know, it's, there's nothing that separates it from a normal gameplay versus a player lock when you're using the pitcher. So that's why I don't post many pitcher player locks. For those of you that may have been requesting pitchers and I haven't done them yet, um, I think what I'm going to do for pitchers is more or less just display it maybe an inning or two of gameplay from it and just kind of do it that way. Brian Braun got thrown out. Here we go. Paul Goldschmidt has to get something going. We are 0-2. Oh, Luckily, the game is tied up, though. But it's bottom of the field, so somebody has to make a move. Right there for strike one. Yeah, the best way to neutralize this guy's power. I usually don't swing at the first right pitch there. just because you know I want to kind of see where the pitcher's going. But sometimes those meatball pitches are just too delicious. Oh, yeah, he's pitching pretty good. Now, I know that he's probably not going to come to that spot again. He's made. He's probably going to go really low or really high. Yep, there you go. So sometimes you kind of have to know just the, the law of, not really the law of averages, but the habits of a, of a typical pitcher and where they will go next. I'm trying to pick up that outside corner, mm -hmm. but this so I knew by him getting me down 0-2 that he was going to waste a couple pitches. Now he may try to come close to the zone now because he don't want to get me in a full count. Oh, he liked it right there, and that's center. a good hit. That's a good hit. Come on, come on Paul. That should be just a double. Oh, it could be a triple. Oh, shoot! Get down. Wow, Paul Goldschmidt in there with a triple. A three bagger. You can't help but think so, about all the men. So, um, gonna get his <laughs> That was a good at bat because one, I, I got down early in that bat, so down 0-2 is just, is not a hitter's count. But I fought back, had good play discipline, and you see the results of that. And I've always told you guys that you know if you have patience at the plate, it will pay off for you. You will get that 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 pitch that you want to drive and and. More often than not, it'll be for a base hit or even a home run. Two out. You better not strike out. Too high there, and maybe a bit outside as well. Two and one. And now with that pitch count getting up there just a little bit, 
you can see that some of these pitches are missing just a little farther away than they were earlier. Wanted to go after the slider, but he holds off. Three, three, one. One. three one. He was hoping he'd get him to go up the ladder there, but that's going to set up an even more dangerous pitch here on foul three ball and one. Well, I tell you. And this is fouled back. Hey, I know this game like the back of my hand. That's all they do is foul balls. <laughs> all they do. You hear me they talking? Strike out. <laughs> You hear me from my, uh, the original commentary talking about how predictable the AI is when they're at the bat. And this one what I tell you? On oh my God, I know this game too well. I knew it. Great pitch there and the <laughs> Inside is over. pitch, he got jammed. No Struck out. After the two out game yeah. predictable, man. Am I raging tonight. a little bit? Sound like I may be raging just a little bit during this gameplay. Man, the lighting in the PS4 is just, I mean, I just can't say enough about it. It's great. It's a tight game. And he gets under this oh, one. that's for me. The ball is skied into very shallow right. And quickly, okay. two are gone now here in the visitor's half there of the sixth. Folks? Dude was right there in front of you. You have to throw it dead hard. Well, you know, it's kind of funny location, that I'm giving you like a dual commentary because I'm listening to myself from the original commentary the and then I'm giving you this live commentary. And it's kind of funny. It. Just kind of, you got you got two Mr. Lux talking to you. Elian Herrera will step in now. He's bounced out and flown Elian out in his first two plate appearances. Maybe I should talk to myself. Maybe that'd be interesting. And no errors on the Milwaukee line score so <laughs> that'd be something new. Do the original commentary and then lace it over with another commentary and just kind of go back and, and forth with yourself. Kind of weird, actually. Never mind. Maybe I should do that. Play there by Montero as he gets him at first to snuff out the bunt. Well, you know, he had a good idea right there. The infield was. All right. Now we're coming off a triple, so let's let's keep the momentum going, Paul. Get down in, man. It's a tight game, close game. We gotta win it. We gotta win it, man. And it begins with you. We follow your lead. Okay, we're actually up by one. Okay. Yep, we're up by one. Now a ball pulled hard but fouled off to the left. That was good solid contact. Got a little excited right there. Come on, Paul. All right, there you the middle, go. The right back up the middle. Reach here. He's got a base hit. Paul has been making some good contact. That was a good hit. Miguel Montero will stand in, and they've been able to hold him in check so far. 0 for 3 to this point. So this game is still uh, within reach for, for anybody's game, so we got to be careful. Now a fastball, and he popped him up. Over toward the left uh, side of the infield. Ramirez is there, one away. One gun down the Arizona seventh. Aaron. And set to go the second baseman, Aaron. We need Hill. you, Aaron. We need you to do Real something. Full count. Of a four three ball game. So he waits back on the change there. That looks and this good. is that looks good. All right. All right. Home run, and baby. Find the seats in left for a home yeah. run. Yeah. Yeah, it puts a little more pressure on the uh, Brewers now. Trying to pull it's away from him now. Shot to oh, straight he's away off. left. That dude's Eight home off. run on the season for him, and it's now six to three. King of the Hill. Oh, that's cool. Oh, his exact name is Hill. Ah, oh, that was nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I was just about to say that. that. Oh. So with a lefty waiting, they'll go to a Wei lefty Chung. of their okay. own out of that the bullpen here. That guy doesn't look like his name should be Wei Chung Wang. I'm going to assume that this is another clip. This is the default generic player face when they don't have the actual art for the mobile. Stand ball. in now following the home run. And you wonder if that losing streak right. is about to go by the wayside. Well, they're not. No, we're yet, putting a pounder on these guys now. Beating them by six runs. Mm -hmm. That could come better than that. All sides seem to be pointing to a potential victory. Swinging a ball hit on the too early. But a foul ball. Too early, man. Too early. Close to the bag, it's second there. Now the pitch, mm. and he takes a cold strike too. I pitch. think that man right there is reaching the end of his wits. I right, want one, oh, one and two. So, right now, and it basically came out of nowhere. 
I hate one and two counts because you can go anywhere with those. Yeah. That sucks. That sucks. Brad Ziegler will come in now working with a huge All right, so lead, so he'll just look oh, and we ended up winning the game. Here. Looks like nine to five. And uh, King here. of the Hill ended up getting a uh, player of the game. Hope you guys enjoyed this player like a Paul Goldschmidt. Like I said, it was requested by so many people. And I'm glad I was able to bring it to you. And if you did enjoy it, as always, don't forget to leave a like. And once you do that, go ahead and check out some of these other videos on the screen right now. And until the next video, I am Mr. Lux, a.k.a. The Merry Gamer, and I'm out. Peace.